the roofs in Cape Coral, Shirley Mungle finds herself anxiously waiting. I'm hoping the, the adjusters said they're going to be out here on Thursday, so hopefully, keep fingers crossed, that they have some good news. Okay. An insurance adjuster, someone to accept or deny damage claims to her roof, pool, and fence. Until they come, she says she feels stuck. Absolutely, we're at the mercy of the adjuster. In the meantime, FEMA Corps team members are on the ground reminding residents that help is out there. Just trying to talk to people in the community as best we can. We're only volunteers, so you know we don't know it all and we can't answer every question, but we're here to support them in any way that we can. Paperwork from Mungle's insurance company seems to be the roadblock, preventing her from getting reassurance and assistance from FEMA. What our goal is, is when we provide home repair money, we, pr we provide that money to make your home safe, sanitary, and secure, which are minimal repairs to allow you to live in that home until you make your long-term re recovery needs. And then a lot of times, uh, most people are referred to Small Business Administration. Mungle only got so far in the FEMA application process while waiting on her insurance company. The very next day, I got a phone call from someone from FEMA, and they told me I qualified for food assistance, which uh, about a week or so after, I got a card for $750. Appreciated, but not the assistance she was looking for. With the proper documentation of coverage, they can really move forward.